self-driven and not self-sufficient, if 7 million people died or starved to death from complications and malnutrition and the Great Depression and then the Great Dust Bowl, what are we talking about in a total collapse here? I mean, is this going to be like uh, the road or something uh, with Vigo Mortensen? I mean, is this going to be some type of hellish situation? Because if we do have a global complete collapse, uh, my God, it's going to be epic what happens. It's the beginning of the first great war of the 21st century. It's already happening. And what they do, for instance, you go over when it happened over in the Middle East, what did they say in Egypt? Well, you know, it's Islamo-fascists. And the same thing in Bahrain. And then when it happens in the UK, they call it hooligans. And it's going to happen in the US, and they're going to say, oh, it's those tea partiers. And when it happens over in Greece, they call it the anarchists. The war is underway. It's class warfare. It's off with their heads 2.0. It's going to be a battle between the, the haves and the have-nots, and only a very few have everything, and way too many have much too little. Gerald Salente, thank you. Uh, you know, the great uh, thing about our TV show is that it's always 30 minutes, but when we need to, we can go longer here at InfoWarsNews.com and uh, the new uh, weeknight transmission. And we really appreciate your tireless work. Now more than ever, alternative media is becoming the mainstream media. That's why we're hearing about Internet kill switches. That's why we're hearing about shutting down people for their speech. We're seeing more and more reports that people criticizing government and being pessimist. We're causing the problems. No, we're pointing out the authors of our economic destruction. And out of this crisis, we could wake people up and have a reawakening to liberty and freedom. And it's thanks to the TrendsJournal.com and TrendsResearch.com that we're able to do this. Gerald, for folks that want to get your uh, trend alerts, one went out yesterday, or they want to get the quarterly uh, detailed Trends Research Journal, how do they find out more? TrendsJournal.com, TrendsJournal.com. And Alex, we know people are having a difficult time. We have a discount request page there. Just fill it out. We'll do our very best to get it to you because the purpose of the Trends Journal is twofold, to inspire people so that they could take their future into their own hands and also prepare them for what comes ahead. And I thank you for what you're doing, but I have to correct you. You're not, all, you're not alternative media. You're the mainstream media. The other one's alternatives. The alternative for losers that want to keep staying lost. ABC, CBS, NBC, the houses of prostitution. Well, more and more we are becoming the new media, the dominant media, and that's why the system is panicking. And you're absolutely right. I, I think one of the last dominoes to fall is that we don't realize we are the majority, but all the numbers, all the research, all the polls, 85% of Americans want to abolish uh, the Fed or at least audit it. Uh, people are really waking up, and that's why, that's why the system is trying to set up this police state. Gerald Salente, thank you so much for joining us. Hey, thank you, Alex. All right, folks, there goes Gerald Salente. Be sure and check out his websites at TrendsJournal.com and TrendsResearch.com. Our websites, of course, are InfoWars.com, PrisonPlanet.tv, and PrisonPlanet.com. We're fighting the creation of a prison planet run by modern 21st century uh, oligarchs trying to put us on the global plantation with the InfoWar. Hence, InfoWars.com and PrisonPlanet.com. I want to thank Paul Watson for joining us earlier with his excellent uh, breakdown of the fact that al-Qaeda... Uh, is now admittedly being put into power in Libya, and that the official 9-11 fable is now being uh, put into the textbooks for our young, uh, helpless people that have been turned over to the government training centers. I want to thank the crew and everyone that makes InfoWars nightly news possible. And we'll see you back unless the wildfires get to us here, and they're pretty close. Uh, Lord willing, tomorrow night, Wednesday evening, 7 p.m. Central, and of course with Alex Jones Live, that's the radio slash TV show from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Central every single weekday as well. I'm Alex Jones signing off from the front lines of the Info War. We'll see you back tomorrow live.